talked about trust in her report and what happened last night reinforces that there's a lack of trust between some members of our community and our police department on social media. People had a lot to say about that, including one of our city council members, Jeremiah Ellison. He posted the Minneapolis Police Department did not kill the man, but people assuming they did is rooted in a steep distrust. So Sharon had a conversation with him about what he said. That distrust is our failure to own. Can you explain a little bit? Yeah, the city enterprise is one institution. Uh, but in a lot of ways, because of how we've allowed our policing institutions to really become their own institution, um, and, and I think that the city enterprise over you know the last 150 years has really allowed for that, um, we really have an independent police force that, that lacks accountability. Did it make you sad or upset that last night was again very clear evidence that there is no trust yeah I, I think it made me sad that um, in an ideal world we would have been able to tell the public what happened without having to show uh, the the tragic last moments of that man's life and the only reason that that was really needed and I think critically needed was because right now I think that the city and, and the police department won't be believed I think partially that's rooted in, in a long history, but I also think it's rooted in the very immediate history of the fact that George Floyd's own death report was, was, was um, mischaracterized. And the anger? I don't think people are mad at only their local police force. I think people are mad at, at policing as an institution. So when Jacob Blake gets shot in the back in Kenosha, Wisconsin, uh, that lands uh, viscerally for people here. When people wake up every day to the fact that Brianna Taylor, that there's been no justice for her murder, uh, people feel that here. How do we even start heading in the right direction of just figuring out what to do with the mistrust? Yeah, you know, I, I think in a lot of ways, the answer is, 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 is what it has been um, for a long time. I, I think that policing as our only means of public safety has been a failure. Uh, I think that, uh, you know, folks don't want to feel like they're occupied. I mean, making people feel like they're occupied is what leads to that powder cake effect. It's what leads to it being completely plausible that the police killed him even when they didn't. There was a lot of discussion, too, about how things were handled last night downtown. There were a lot of people down there for a very long period of time. There were police, protesters, even activists. Businesses had things stolen, fires broke out. So folks who own those businesses and work there want answers as well. And to talk about